Right now at 6, we continue to follow breaking news from Gastonia. Police on the scene after a shooting at the East Ridge Mall. Here's what we know. Officials say four people were shot around noon. Three of them are expected to be okay. We're working to get an update on the fourth victim. We also know that authorities have two people in custody. Both are considered persons of interest here. We want to get out to our Brianna Harper, who's been out at the mall gathering details, talking to witnesses. Bree, what have you learned tonight? Yeah, Vanessa, just within the last couple minutes, I got a phone call from Gastonia police and they tell me that a 17 year old has been charged with several felonies related to this shooting. That other person of interest, a 23 year old, has not yet been charged. But those shots that were allegedly fired by that 17 year old certainly caused a lot of panic for folks who were here inside the East Ridge Mall. Now, here's video that a witness shared with us of that chaotic scene after those shots were fired, a huge police presence in the parking lot. We're told initially police say two men and a woman were all taken to the hospital with non threatening, non life threatening injuries after they were shot. This is cell phone video from inside the mall as EMS crews were treating one of those gunshot victims. And then a short time later, police identified a fourth victim who showed up to the hospital with a bullet wound. Now, as you can imagine, it was a chaotic scene for Charlotte for, for mall customers who say their only focus was safety. You just didn't know. You know, you heard food court, but then once you hear that, you don't know who it is, where it is, if they're coming after you, what, you know, you just don't know where they're at. So we hurried out of the building and got in the car. And police say at this moment they are trying to review surveillance video from inside the mall. They were also able to recover two guns. One of those guns are found near the food court here in the mall and then another gun found in the nearby woods in this area. So this is still an ongoing, very active investigation and we'll keep you updated with any new updates we learn. For now, reporting live in Gastonia, Brianna Harper, WCNC, Charlotte.